Google search Krakow free cat mocks. Click on the first link. You can attempt three latest cat mocks in the actual exam interface. After completing the test, you get detailed solutions, analysis, percentile, along with your scorecard to gauge your all India performance. Click on the solution to get video solutions from our expert faculty. Hello everyone, welcome to Krakow video series. Mocks important in care preparation. It will help the aspirants test themselves and predict how well the preparation is going. Taking more mocks will make the aspirants much stronger in CAT preparation. If you have experienced a low score in CAT mocks in the past, you will know how much it takes to come out of this situation. The best way to tackle this problem is to analyze your mocks thoroughly. Reduce the frequency at which you are attempting mocks and devote additional time to analyzing. Also some experts even claim that you should spend more time analyzing mocks than giving them. So in this video, we will discuss how to analyze mocks and how to improve the mock score in each section. And also at the end, we will look into how many mocks to take before CAT in detail. Apart from this, if you want to take CAT mocks, we are giving you three free CAT mocks with detailed video solutions. And also for referring CAT previous years papers, we are providing you with the PDFs with the detailed video solutions for all the questions. The links for the both mock tests and the CAT previous years papers are given in the description. So please check them out. So let's get started. Now let us see each and every steps in analyzing the CAT mocks. So firstly, revisit the all unattempted questions or wrongly answered questions. You might miss out questions cause of various reasons such as unfamiliar with the concepts, might have studied the concept in the past but do not remember it at the moment. One of the reasons that could proceed to a specific point but could not go ahead further and also making some calculation mistakes or not having time to attempt the questions. So these are some of the reasons that you might miss out the questions while attempting a mock. So most of the reasons stated here corresponding to DILR and quant whereas VARC it is all about comprehension and retention. Hence, there cannot be a possibility of forgetting a concept. After analyzing the wrongly answered questions, now have a look at the correctly answered questions. Analyzing these questions are also important. See how much time you consumed on each question and try to find out better ways to solve such questions to take less time. Managing time while taking mock will also help you to improve your score. The exam duration is 2 hours. So it is better to maintain a stopwatch while taking a mock. This process will make you understand how much time you spend on each question and help you to improve your time management skills which are very essential while taking the actual exam. Next, whenever you revisit the unanswered questions, you can understand in which areas you are weak. Check out the weak areas and focus more and strengthen your weak areas for the next mock. Keeping an eye on strong areas is also important. Having more grasp on your strong areas will help you solving the questions much faster. And next, experiment various exam strategies in upcoming mocks. That is, suppose you are taking a mock starting with a VRC section and analyze how good you are when you start with this section. Check out uh, how comfortable you feel. Are you getting any pressure while solving this section? So similarly apply this process in every mock. So find out how much time you consume while taking every mock or list out all your mistakes. Find the different approaches for solving the mock and select a strategy that suits you the best. Now let us see how to improve score in CAT mocks. A commonly utilized strategy is to break down your scoring process into multiple rounds. So in this strategy, there will be multiple rounds. In the first round, attempt the easy questions, the one you are 100% sure about getting correct. In the second round, solve the questions that you avoided because you found them time consuming or difficult to understand. So continue this process till you feel satisfied with your performance. So this is bound to improve your mock score over time. And next. Choosing the right question to attempt makes all the difference. This is only possible if you know your strengths and weaknesses well. It also depends on your ability to distinguish between time consuming questions from ones that can be solved quickly. Preferring to solve the questions of strong areas will improve your mock score and save you valuable time a lot while taking mock. The ability to correctly identify or leave questions will keep on improving 
as you continue taking mocks. Let us see how to improve score in each section per cat. Firstly, let us see for the DILR section. Try to solve the puzzles such as Sudokus in your free time to improve logical thinking skills. Improve your thought process. Practice various types of sets. Take a good number of mocks and analyze them thoroughly and do not spend unreasonable time on a single set. It is very important point to be considered while taking the exam. And finally, improve your time management skills while taking mocks. And next for the VARC section, focus more on the basic concepts of verbal ability. And next, make a habit of reading newspapers, articles, etc. for improving your reading skills. And next, take two RCs in a day if there is any possibility. If not, take at least one RC daily and reading daily is the most important task to ace this section. And finally, if you are a beginner or trying to improve score, avoid speed reading, skimming, surfing and other gimmicky techniques while taking an RC. And next, let us see how to improve score in quad section. Quant is a section where one can score higher than the other sections in the CAT exam. Quant plays a vital role to score high in this section. Having a solid grasp of basics including formulas is necessary. So without solid fundamentals, one cannot ace this section. And next, try to find out the better ways of solving the given questions. Because at the time of the actual exam, the simple way of solving the questions help in saving your valuable time as the exam duration is only two hours. Focus on improving the speed and accuracy. Mainly focus on accuracy, which is very important because there is no point in solving more number of problems very fast but inaccurately. And finally, do not spend too much time on a single topic and finally how many mocks to take before cat so in this month that is october you should give at least one to two mocks per week and at the same time try to spend maximum time to strengthen your fundamentals you should be done with most topics by the october end in the month of november try to give three mocks per week this will be enough to land you in a comfortable position before the cat so this is all about the analyzing of cat mocks apart from this if you have any doubts regarding the cat zat cmat nmat or any other mba exams you can ask your doubt on our web page called kraku adda where you can post your doubt and your doubt will be resolved by the experts and also will be notified immediately whenever your doubt get resolved so the link for the Kraku Adda is given in the description so please check it out so thank you so much guys and all the best